If we consider the reforms of Pericles uh, in the 5th century BC, we have to understand that in particular he creates uh, a specific type of politics in relation in particular with the middle class. In fact, uh, uh, the politics of Pericles uh, is that politics that uh, uh, would like to, uh, to, to, to support uh, the, popular, uh, the popular class. In particular because uh, after the reform of Clisthenes, uh, not only uh, the aristocrats could participate at the defense of the territory and therefore could participate at uh, the public situation, but, uh, and therefore, uh, Pericles uh, uh, had to uh, consider this implication, therefore the reform of Clisthenes uh, that uh, was uh, uh, created uh, in the end of the 6th century BC. Uh, Pericles uh, lived in 5th century BC, in particular he took the power uh, during uh, the 460 uh, BC and maintained this power uh, uh, for, 30, for 30 years, in particular uh, uh, when uh, he was uh, died uh, in uh, 429. And this is interesting because in this period, uh, uh, in, in this period, in these uh, uh, years, Pericles uh, uh, did uh, a lot of reforms, in particular uh, also applied a specific type of uh, point of view in relation with uh, Athens. Athens, uh, according to Pericles, uh, had to uh, consider by uh, the Greek people, uh, the Greeks, uh, as uh, a very important city and at the same time a city that uh, had uh, an important economic, uh, 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 economic relation with the other cities. In particular, in fact, in the period of Pericles, uh, uh, the fleet, uh, the ships, the war uh, of sh the ships of war, uh, was uh, created a lot uh, and, and was maintained with uh, uh, with uh, with citizens that uh, applied a, a, s a sort of uh, politics to maintain the, the fleet. In fact, in the period of Pericles, uh, we can consider that uh, Athens had. Uh, uh, 200 and uh, 400 ships, uh, probably a number that uh, uh, was uh, in relation with uh, these two numbers. And uh, another point of view that it is really important is that uh, in this period uh, was uh, uh, built, uh, uh, built the Delian League, uh, uh, a relation between Athens and his uh, allies. In particular, this league was uh, um, a sort of uh, alliance that uh, uh, Athens uh, built before Pericles, but at the same time that Pericles uh, decided to maintain. In particular, uh, this uh, alliance uh, was created to defend the Greek people against um, the potential uh, new attack uh, of the Persian Empire, in particular because uh, in the end of 480 um, and in the end of the Second uh, um, Greek, Persian Greek War, the Greeks won against the Persians and uh, was uh, created some. Uh, once constituted some accords, some deals uh, with uh, the uh, before between the Greek people and uh, the Persians. In this relation, we understand that, uh, in particular with the Peace of Callias, um, there there was uh, there were decided some uh, some territories, some lands. Uh, uh, and therefore, uh, were uh, people of Greece. Uh, could uh, go and at the same time people of Persia could go and uh, was decided also some uh, lands uh, to maintain uh, a specific type of exchanges um, with uh, uh, the, the, the relation between uh, the different type of people uh, barbarians and uh, Greece uh, because according to the Greek people, the Persians was, were barbarians. Uh, Pericles maintained this political, in particular the Italian League, uh, was a relationship between the polis, uh, in particular Athens and his allies, but Athens uh, became uh, with time a sort of uh, 
uh, city that uh, monopolized this alliance. In particular, Athens imposed a lot of taxes uh, on the allies, um, and uh, with this uh, imposition, decided also to maintain a sort of uh, new Greek empire, a sort of new Greek empire. In fact, uh, Uh, we, have the, we have to speak, um, in any case, uh, of city-states. City-states uh, uh, that were in relationship with independence, but at the same time in relation, in this case, with Athens. That uh, with uh, the taxes, uh, the money of uh, the Delia League, uh, continue to build uh, the, his fleet, uh, his ships, uh, to maintain his ships, uh, Uh, and at the same time, uh, increasing uh, his power, uh, a sort of violence against uh, the allies, uh, but also uh, maintain a sort of uh, politics in relation with the Persians. And uh, in any case, Pericles uh, in this period uh, continued to uh, build um, the, um, the walls of Athens, uh, that uh, began uh, to build uh, in the period of Themistocles after the Second uh, uh, Persian War. Pericles continued this build, uh, this building, and at the same time uh, also decided to create a reform uh, to limit uh, the citizens. In particular, uh, that reform uh, which um, explained that, uh, explain that uh, To become a citizen of Athens, you had to be uh, a son of uh, a father of Athens, but your mother had to uh, be a daughter of uh, a man of Athens, a citizen of Athens. And therefore, we understand uh, that this type of reform limit the citizen, or, uh, or better, limited the right to be a citizen. A citizen. In any case, Pericles, uh, uh, this reform uh, uh, was a reform of 454 BC. Um, sorry, uh, 451 BC. But uh, in fact, in 454 BC, uh, Pericles decided to uh, took the box of the Delia League, this box where uh, Athens put the taxes of the allies and put this box into Athens in the Parthenon, a structure, a temple that Pericles uh, built uh, in, in, in 5th century BC um, in the, in the, at the top of Athens on the Acropolis, the top part of, of Athens. Remember that uh, the ancient city-states uh, were divided in three parts, the Acropolis, the top of the city, the Asti, uh, the, uh, the city in general where uh, people lived, and uh, um, the, the part of the lands uh, Uh, where people uh, uh, cultivate the lands um, uh, and uh, where there was uh, the agriculture uh, to support, for example, the economy of the city. Athens was divided in this, for example, free part. Uh, and in, it is interesting because uh, Pericles used uh, his influence to uh, maintain also a sort of new type of reform uh, in relation with uh, a support of dead people that uh, didn't know the aristocrats but at the same time didn't uh, uh, weren't uh, a part of the middle class uh, in particular uh, that they that people who didn't have a work um, And this reform permitted uh, uh, um, to these people to participate uh, at the defense of the territory and to have some money to sustain uh, themselves, uh, in particular because uh, uh, Pericles with this reform decided uh, to create a, core, a relationship between these people and the fleet uh, to, um, to create uh, this relationship, uh, creating this relationship uh, Uh, putting uh, some people uh, of uh, this uh, class uh, uh, to, uh, to, to, to in relation with the ships. Uh, they, uh, they would have been uh, 
thought would have uh, been for they fought uh, in, uh, in in on the ships uh, and therefore they could participate at uh, the defense of a territory therefore they could participate at the political situation uh, this type of reforms was an anti aristocrat uh, an anti aristocrat reform because uh, uh, decided to uh, put the other classes, other the middle class, uh, at the center of the politics of Athens. In any case, Pericles decided also to accept the uh, declaration of war uh, of Sparta uh, in, uh, in, uh, in the 431 BC, uh, because according to Thucydides, uh, the, uh, Athens, the economy of Athens, the politics of Athens, uh, uh, become uh, uh, lead, uh, uh, really dangerous uh, for Sparta, in particular because Athens uh, uh, was creating uh, an important economy uh, in relation also with uh, a lot of cities of the Aegean Sea. Instead, Sparta uh, maintained uh, always uh, an economy uh, in relation with the cities of uh, the Peloponnese, the Peloponnese uh, not uh, in relation with uh, the economy of the Aegean Sea. Some cities uh, with uh, a relationship of peace or, and uh, uh, some allies uh, with Sparta maintained some politics uh, in, in this sense with uh, some island, for example, of uh, Aegean Sea. An, an example is Corinth that uh, uh, had uh, also some relationships uh, with uh, some island. Uh, an another cause that could uh, uh, could be a possible, a potential uh, cause of the uh, Peloponnesian War was the relationship between uh, um, Athens and uh, Corcyra, Corfu, uh, because Corfu was uh, in the past in relation with Corinth and Corinth was uh, in relation with uh, Sparta in the uh, Peloponnesian League, but at the same time Corcyra Corfu decided to uh, create uh, an accord, a deal uh, with Athens. And this uh, uh, deal, uh, in particular, uh, was considered by the Corinth and at the same time by the Spartans as a sort of indirectly attack, uh, was considered a sort of indirect attack against uh, the interest of uh, the Peloponnese. Therefore, there was, uh, so uh, to see this explained, the declaration of war by the Peloponnese, in particular by Sparta. Bye.